Hey guys, welcome back. Today I wanted to show you everything that came in my January Sephora Play Box. And if you don't know about this, this is a monthly beauty subscription box. And this is from Sephora. And what they do is they give you five deluxe sample size products and one fragrance product as a sample. And you get this once a month and it is $10 a month. So I've been doing it for about three months now and I like to put a video up each month showing everything that comes in the box as well as two other um, beauty subscription boxes that I have. I also upload videos showing everything that comes in those every month. Just to give you guys an idea of what they are, what they have to offer in case it's something that you may be interested in. So I'm just going to start right in. It comes in the mail in a box like this. And then you open it up and it has the little pamphlet which tells you about some of the products that are inside and you usually get a little just a uh, little drawstring bag so this is what this month's looks like okay so for this month it looks like they included two makeup products and those I left off my face when I did my makeup today so that I could apply those here with you guys and then three skincare products this one is sugar advanced therapy by Fresh. It's a lip treatment. And that's what it looks like. It feels very smooth and very hydrating. There's not much of a scent to it. Maybe, maybe a hint of a mint fragrance to it. The next product is from Clinique. It's Pep Start Eye Cream. I love trying new eye creams. So I will definitely get good use out of that. And I think this is a, a, well actually, you can see the line. It's only filled up to here. I don't know if you can see that on camera, but yeah, there, it looks like there's really not much in here at all. You can see, oh my God, can you see that? There's like nothing in there. So the eye cream a little bit really goes a long way. So I could probably get at least a week out of this to test it and to see if I like it and if it makes a difference compared to the ones I already use. And then we have a Glam Glow Super Cleanse Clearing Cream to Foam Cleanser. And that's what that looks like. Glam Glow is a really great brand that I have heard of, have heard, heard good things about, but have not tried yet. So I'm really excited to try that out. And then for the lip product, it's NARS. It's a lipstick. And it's in the color Orgasm, which I think I have that blush, or I have a sample of that blush. So let's see what this looks like. I love NARS packaging because it has this really soft feel to it. Cute little mini lipstick. And it looks like a nude with a little hint of peach in there. So we'll try this on. Hey, Sadie. Okay, so that's a very light color. I do like it. I think it's pretty. It's a very sheer color. That's what it looks like, swatched. So it's very, very sheer and it has some shimmer. I think this would be great for an everyday, daytime look. And that's the beauty of these um, subscription boxes that have the samples because you can try things without having to, pay, you know, spend, what, 20 to $30 on a full-size lipstick, you get all these samples for $10 to try out, and the ones you absolutely love, you can then go out and repurchase at full price. Now, <clears throat> the last product besides the fragrance is Becca. It's a shimmering skin perfecter. It's liquid, and it's an opal. So we're going to put that on today, too. Okay, and it comes in a little tube like this. I'm just going to apply this with my fingertip. I'm just going to dab it along my cheekbone here. That's what that looks like. I'm sure I could build it up, but I'm just going in light today. And for the fragrance this month, it's um, YSL Mon Perry. And I was really excited to get this one because I just went through a sample of this perfume and I really like it. So I, I want to wear it some more and see if it's something I would want to purchase because perfumes are very expensive. But this perfume, it just, it smells so good and there's like this deep, musky undernote to it that, I don't know, there's something about it I really like. I think it's a great fragrance for winter and it goes so well with this hand cream. This is called Social Butterfly and this is a candied blackberry and jasmine scented hand cream. And 
I don't know what it is, but these two, just this perfume with this hand cream pair so well together. I've been wearing these a lot. And I'm wondering if the uh, YSL perfume has jasmine in it. I'm not sure. There's just some, there's an undernote to both of these that smells so similar and they just pair so well together. So I was really happy to get that fragrance because I know it's one that I, I like. And so that is everything that came in this month's Sephora Playbox. Well, in January, I'll be posting this video or uploading it in February. So this is everything from the January box. And I'm wondering if this says anything that I should talk about. Okay, so it says the YSL has, um, it's a sparkling fragrance that embodies the spirit of Paris and features notes of red berries, pear, and creamy white musk. So I wonder if it's the pear and the white musk that similar to this hand cream but I just love them together and I just thought I'd share that with you um that is everything that came in this month's box again I post every month that I get the Sephora play box and I am going to be doing a video soon of all three of them that I have including one other one that I used to have and comparisons of all four and pros and cons to each one and my preference just to give you guys an outline of you know, price comparison, product comparison in the boxes, and maybe to help you if you're wanting to pick one but you don't know which one, I'm hoping that this video will educate everybody and give them some, you know, hints on what their preference may be. So keep a lookout for that, and I'll see you in the next video, guys. Bye!